Welcome to leaving California. So many times we talk about the cons of living in San Francisco, living in Los Angeles, living in California, and we talk about why people are leaving. But today's video, we'll be talking about the good of San Francisco, of Los Angeles, and all of California. But before we get started in this video, my name is Justin Lee, this is Jeffrey De Azuz. We are licensed real estate agents here in the Bay Area, helping countless individuals like yourself move out of California or within California, That's across right. the Bay Bridge, across the Golden Gate Bridge, you name it, we're here to help. If you have any questions about relocating, reach out to us and we'll guide you through every step of the way. But with that said, let's hop into this video. What are some pros that California, San Francisco, Los Angeles has to offer? Well, you know, me from being from San Francisco, I think one of the most beautiful things is when you drive over the Golden Gate Bridge from Marin County into San Francisco, that is one of the most beautiful drives that I've ever been on in my life. Mm. I mean, San Francisco, Bay Area, and actually California itself has some of the best and most beautiful landscapes, hills and mountains, and you know, some of the roads are just beautiful along the coast. But some of the things I do enjoy, let me talk for myself. I love Buena Vista Cafe. They have some Irish coffees. I love them. I don't drink them every day, but when I do go into San Francisco, that is one stop I must do. Along with Crustaceans, which is a great crab place over in California, Polk Street. I mean, the food in Chinatown and all over the Bay Area is great. That's right. And don't forget the Mediterranean weather too. Right now we're up in country, a little bit cold up here, but if you go to Los Angeles, it is like 70 degrees, 80, 80 degrees yeah. in December. That's a beautiful weather. We don't get seasons. We don't have to shovel snow in the morning. You don't have to worry about ice on the roads. You don't have to worry about slipping in your car. Those are the good things about California. But with that said, there are individuals and clients of ours that come to us and ask us, I want to move, but I just can't because my favorite sports team, the <laughs> Golden State Warriors, are here in the Bay Area. How can I leave them behind and go to Texas or Florida or Washington? Well, you know, Justin, that's a pretty good question, but I'm going to tell you, you, know, you don't have to give up your sports team if you move out of the area. You could always be a Giants fan living in Texas. Actually, you could be rooting for your San Francisco Giants when they come into the Texas Rangers Stadium. So that's always fun. Or, you know, the Houston Astros. It's always nice to be on the opposing side. I mean, a matter of fact, I was just at the bo the, the garden at the Boss mm. Boston Celtics and Warriors uh, championship game last year. So that was a lot of fun. I got a lot of interesting finger pointing at me. Uh, a <laughs> it was a little bit more than that, Justin. Oh, but it was great. Me and my family had a great time. And guess what? If people do move out of California and they sold their house in California, it's just like gold. You know, like gold? Oh, looks, sounds, sounds luxurious. <laughs> <laughs> but yes. I agree with that because we have a lot of individuals we interviewed who have sold their house in California and started buying investment properties across the country. That's right. They bought themselves a big house mansion and they have some money left over to buy two, three investment properties across the country, which is an amazing accomplishment. You know, let me, let me elaborate on that. If you are going from check to check, imagine you have a house here in California, which is like I said, worth more than gold and you sold that home for 1.5 million and then you're able to buy a home or a mansion in another state for cash and then you were able to buy two investment properties both renting at let's say $2,500 each that's $5,000 a month I mean but here in California you're going from month to month barely paying your bills renting out rooms just to stay afloat mm. and that's no way to live Imagine you had a paid off home, but you had two investments property giving you $5,000 a month plus your retirement check. That would just be amazing. This is. So if you have any questions about relocating out of California or if you know anybody that are thinking about relocating out of California, but maybe they're a little afraid of doing so because of their sports team or <laughs> any of the reasons, the weather, just have them reach out to us and we'll guide them and make sure they're taken care of. But anyways, thank you for watching this video. If you found it informative, and entertaining make sure you leave a like comment subscribe and we'll see you in the next video